Here we have a basketball and a tennis ball. You can see when they are dropped from a certain height, they will bounce back up to a certain height. The tennis ball is placed on top of the basketball and both of them are let go. This is a case of where the force of the basketball going up is added to the force of the tennis ball going up and the forces are added together creating a greater force that pushes the tennis ball to a much higher height. Now we have a golf ball and a ping pong ball and they are dropped from a certain height and you can see how high they bounce back up. Now we're going to do the same thing as before and place the ping pong ball on top of the golf ball and let them go. Just like before, the two forces are added together to create a greater force that propels the ping pong ball to a much greater height than before. Now we have a system of five balls lined up on top of each other and we're going to drop these straight down. The five balls add the forces together creating a much greater force to push the top two balls at a very high speed in an upward direction.